You talked to David Tepper, of course, of Appaloosa when you were there, and he had some comments on yes, the coronavirus, too. Take a listen. We're trying to back engineer it ourselves right now, so I think that's what you got to do is try to figure it out. Certainly ruined uh, the, the environment and the setup right now, so it's and what, brand new. So. And what's important, I know that you, you talked to Joe, it was a good time, but this does, it's a game changer, uh, so we, isn't it? It was a, it, you ha it, you have to be careful because it may be a game changer. So you just got to be cautious. And two weeks ago, you, you before the virus, it was one thing, yeah. and it's a different environment right now. So that's what it is. Yeah, I think it's important to recognize that how hard it is to listen to a hedge fund manager who's really great. And I've regarded David. I've known David since 1982, and I think he's a rigorous guy. I was interviewing people. You know, I was interviewing all these Hall of Fame guys and players, general managers. I was having a great time. I threw in a question to David, not just about the Panthers, but this. And I, when it was cognizant because it, 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 Joe Kernan had gotten the call saying that it was positive. And he just wanted to make sure, listen, that's no longer right. the and view. Listen, and that all, you know, allocators of capital right now are asking the same questions. Right. We don't have, there aren't a lot of answers, uh, uh, clearly. I've got hedge funds who are, can get people on the phone over there talking to virology professors at places like the Chinese Academy of Sciences well, in Wuhan going? trying to understand what's going right. on. And everybody's doing that, Jim, um, to understand the impact. What I'll tell you that I can see like, firsthand is talking to people who are supposed to go to Singapore today. Not going. Not going. Uh, right. For a business meeting. Business meetings right now in the United States, if anybody has been to China in the last two weeks, you can't come to the meeting or the meeting is put off. If you've met with anybody separately who is in China and you're planning on coming to the meeting, you can come to the meeting. So this is having an impact yes. in this that is, way right. and that, therefore, things are simply going to slow down. Right. I, I, I've done the same calls, medical people, many of the major pharmaceutical companies that say, look, we can get a vaccine, but this is a brand new virus and the vaccine is going to take a long time. They're all counting on the quarantine to work. Uh, and the numbers from Mo it might count as a typical piece of saying that there's 65 could be attracting a minimum of 65,000 cases in China. There's a tremendous, uh, let's say, uh, skepticism about how the PRC has treated this. A lot of anger about it, by the way. And I think on that, both sides. Yeah. Yes. And I think the rancor toward the United States is unfortunate. Uh, but I would say if you step away, I don't talk to anyone who says, look, Jim, assure people. And one of the things that I said to David was, David, could you reassure us? And, and he said, why? You know, basically, why should I reassure? That, that's certainly not the right tenor. Uh, it's more important to not be on margin. And uh, I found it very sobering. I also found it, anyone, there were many people in travel at the uh, Super Bowl, and I felt that those stocks need to be sold. Yeah, uh, we'll talk about the RCL downgrade today. Why then does Morgan Stanley come out again and say support at 3,100? Tom Lee, well-known right. stubborn bull, uh, even at 30, 30, 11, you know, the 200 days, they think that is more solid footing. Well, look, I think the line in the sand is not worthwhile given the caucuses tonight uh, because you kind of have a one two punch. I mean, you could come in tomorrow and a, maybe a socialist wins the caucus. And the socialist says, don't own the bank stocks. And then the uh, tenure says, don't own the bank stocks. I mentioned that because bank stocks are a huge part of the S&P. A lot of tech is China. Well, healthcare also weakened on a, on a, on a Sanders uh, exactly. the view of a potential Sanders win tonight. Right. So, I mean, uh, I, I don't... Look, I'm not saying sell everything. That's, that's a sucker's game. That's systemic risk. That's uh, 2007. I am saying the Tepper, saying it's a game changer. I have to be cautious. Look, I'm not going to take my cue from anyone, but when, uh, I love David Tepper. But I will listen to him and try to be thoughtful and take him into... Uh, but it's part of the right to your point, though. You can take in as many inputs as possible, but it's still novel. The, the, they the keep coronavirus that. itself is novel, How do you and therefore, me? right, this is not something we've completely dealt with. It is similar to SARS, but not right. the same. And right. certainly, China's economy has grown enormously Important. since uh, SARS hit. It is similar to other pandemics, perhaps, but not the same. And so, it's just very difficult to know. And the world has changed since. Right. And, uh, the last one, whatever you want to call it. I mean, I, you're so right, David. I mean, when I speak to the medical professionals, and I'm sitting there making calls at the Super Bowl, and I keep coming back with the same thing, which is, we don't really have anything. Let's hope the quarantine works. We don't really have anything. No. We have something, and a year from now, it could be very good. None of these things makes me feel like, hey, i got to go in and buy Tesla. And I like Tesla. I, I think Tesla's great, but it's up 25. I mean... I just say don't buy this don't buy this route. How about that? Don't right. buy the route. Uh, speaking of playbooks, uh, you did talk to Tepper about you said margin and leverage. Yes. Take a listen to that as well. 
Can I just get from you, it's not the time if you're a long-term person to quit, right? You know what, I think you, if, if you're a long-term person, you better not be uh, leveraged. All right, C concise? Yes, <laughs> uh, but I had thought, and what, wait, look, you can't tell people what you want to hear. I thought he'd say, look, I don't think this is something that will be with us for a long time. Uh, I subsequently talked to David the next day, we were just trying to clarify again, and he basically said, listen, if you're on margin, go. Now, I think a lot of our viewers are on margin. What does that connote? What he's saying is, look, it, it could, you could lose a lot of money here because it, when you get hurt on margin, you, right. you, you get hurt. But David, by no means, I want to be sure about this, is saying, I want everybody out because that's not his job. He's protecting his own First of all, people. he's not a medical professional. Right. He has absolutely no, no he asked me if I'd seen the than any of us have. He's yeah. just a guy who understands and knows markets and investor psychology. Right. And that's so that's what, where we right. want to listen right. to Right, him. that's why. I mean, his view of No, he and I have both read the Lancet article. The Lancet article, for lack of a better term, is very Stephen King-like. Um, it's very the stand-like. Yes. In the sense that there are going to be these clusters that are going to be mini epidemics. And the mini epidemics are in cities where people have come back to in this country. And again, I mean, is it scary? I don't feel assured. When you go in an airport and you see so many people with masks, and there's also a dramatic decline in people there, you say, wow, am I even taking it? You, you get very, um, let's say, unsure of yourself. How about that? Yeah. That's where we are. Yeah. That's probably where we're going to be. I'm sure. For a while. Is that? Maybe until May when the warm weather comes. Well, they say a Lance, this is April. Yeah. <laughs> now, when you, but the other thing is this vaccine. Remember, we're a rigorous country. You can't, you have to test it. But the Chinese, I don't think they have the time to test.